this is a shot uh, inside one of my sets. Here is my assistant, Max, putting fog on the stage. This, in, this is a new project I'm working right now, um, and it's still in production. Uh, this is the second phase where I already have veiled some backdrops and I'm taking the final shots. Later, I will go to the dark room and develop these images that they are based on archival images from the early labor unions. Uh, and the way that we work on them is building the sets. Um, the, here you can see the scale. And then we appropriate and build a bunch of uh, objects that resemble machine or, or like machinery and also objects that have uh, alien qualities and that we create this environment of uh, like the city and the factories have been abandoned and these machines are taking over. So in, this is one of my, this is a final image that you can see of uh, how the work gonna look like after it's developed. Um, it's in a similar way I work uh, during my last show, uh, Journeyman, where I build all the objects out of concrete and later I transfer them into copper plates to do photogravures. In this case, I make uh, objects out of plaster um, concrete molds using a styrofoam packaging that I found in the street. Uh, so it was very heavy and very hard to work, but the final technique that I decided to use was this um, photogravures, which is the um, earliest way to reproduce photographic prints. Uh, the image gets transferred on a copper plate and then acid with acid etched onto the the surface and then the ink get um, rubbed against the surface so is the the oil what is interesting is like it's so on the surface but when you put the paper on it that is wet uh, the ink gets uh, inside the fiber of the paper so it gives you this very beautiful black chalky um, material um, quality, as you can see in the close-ups. Uh, this is was made in the studio in Mexico City uh, with uh, Sopilote that I've been working for about a year with them. Um, and then once we have the installation done and the, all the images produced, uh, I start working on ceramics that you can see now, um, and I transform the gallery space. Uh, I made this fake uh, floor so the sculptors could see it underground and you could see them from a bird's eye view perspective. In that way you can hear your steps on the on the gallery and you can have a photographic view of the objects that in some somewhat of a conversation with the photographs and the objects being depicted in the photograph. Uh, 